be dropping off some front diffs for Jess Mooney. That's what's down there. Got my breakfast of champions and nothing to lose. This is a rather familiar story. Come on baby. Come on. So this is wild. Aaron just messaged and uh, it looks like he and Lee are only about 10 miles ahead of me. Let's see here. It's chilly. Loose. Yeah. <laughs> oh. <laughs> wow, Lee. So, That's rude. No, but it's true. <laughs> That's not rude. It's true, right? Well, I... Damn it. It's <laughs> time to go back out. Oh, I didn't realize there are two groups. There's still more people over there. Hmm. Aaron, why'd you cause the power outage? <laughs> I was uh, using a hairdryer on my beautiful, luscious locks. Yeah. Actually, I was not. I, he realized he grabbed a, and stuff the heat there. gun and not the hairdryer. <laughs> <laughs> you know, the JROTC kids were sitting there. And you know what Lee said to him? He was like, you know, y'all looked a little loose. Well, she asked how we looked out there. I said, well, be, you know, y'all look pretty loose. I hope, I hope she knows who she asked. Well, I mean, that she, they need to know that, right? Yeah. But how do you know is the thing? Well, because, you know, I know. I know what, look, see, this lady's not as loose as they are. I'm just saying, she's marking back. Uh, 
Well, that one is. But yeah, you might need corn meal. Yeah. And if nothing else, I've got asparagus. Are you on that? Ben has his. Maybe we can get Ben, get some drinks, and then we can take it for a ride. Kill everybody with sweetness and kindness. Yeah. So all those haters, right? You know, are like, how how could we do this to this man? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. There's Aaron. All you have to do to score a sweet keychain is to run. Ten thousand dollars worth of their products and have twenty-five thousand dollars. <laughs> <laughs> oh my! like I kind of popped the or at least pitched the beat Things. Well, we need that tire. I thought I forgot who I was talking to. <laughs> well, you think that I'm gonna magically remember and know where your damn air down shit is? Oh, thank you. Patch kind of went off the road. Says he popped a beer on a couple tires. Let's go see what's up. Well, I mean, if you're gonna, well, yeah. if you're gonna go oh, off, you might as well do it right. Aaron with the tripod. Right? That's right.
I might actually be legally blind after all. Oh yeah. <laughs> Perhaps I should get my eyesight checked. Well, unfortunately, I didn't get any video of it, but I smashed into the bank. I was going a little too fast around the corner, and, you know, Lee comes over the radio and says, Hey, watch out for that, and, you know, it was too late. Uh, but jumped the truck about 20 feet, maybe 30, I don't know, and when it came back down, both the driver's side wheels you know the tires popped off the beads uh, of the wheel so we got those reseated unfortunately one of the valve stems uh, cracked off like the the rubber boot that sits behind the wheel sort of like just you know got ripped off so I'm I have five good tires but I'd need a valve stem I'm gonna add that to my list of spares to pack Apparently it's necessary. Hey, what was that, Rick? What was that? I don't know. Yeah. There's a lot of something moving. I don't know either. We're not sure what that was, Lee. Aaron and I were discussing it. What was that noise? We have no idea. I mean, I don't think I could have been... It didn't, you didn't hit anything. Yeah. Right side's coming down. See what that is. Okay, stop for, I don't know what that is. seven o'clock and set up for camp somewhere uh, so you know just a couple more minutes of this and hopefully we can find a decent looking spot hitting this big ass rock he yeah. got up on it and then drug it backwards yeah so it's either i'm thinking you just gotta give it a little bit of something yeah yeah i mean here there <laughs> Yeah, so your your pumpkin gets caught in this rock that's perfectly pumpkin shaped. Yeah, got a nice so little look on. So if you could put your passenger tire on that rock, you'll pop over. Uh, you'll have to drop off this guy to get far enough back.
right, let's go, Sergi. bit more passenger just to line yourself up there and now you're coming down a ledge straighten up you'll just float on down yep there she goes <laughs> give it passenger give it a little passenger yeah, there you go. Good work, Lee. Do you, are you spotting him? Or do you need me to, or? Good so far. I'm just sliding on the Ah, now you're, now you're centered, uh, high centered. So. Yeah, I'd say. Whoa! Well, is he moving in it? Did you move it all? No, he didn't. I'm well, sure I his mean, wheels are spinning when he... When yeah. He that wheel. You're, yeah, just making sure your wheels are spinning when you're... They are. Now yeah, don't start the winch until you start spinning. Wheels. Yeah, wheels first, then winch. Yeah, it's moving. Well, Aaron uh, decided that the camp spot we passed wasn't uh, was too exposed, so we're trekking through the desert at night. But I mean, at least the stars are out. Well, against all odds, we were able to make it to a campsite. So we're crashing here for the evening. Uh, and then it's headed up the mountain tomorrow. We shall see. Hmm.